And hey there guys, I'm Gerotino. Welcome back to some more Pikmin. Last, last episode we finished off the forest naval. Um, we're gonna dive right into the forest to help. We have four pieces today, two boss battles, and I want to raise my blue population. So we actually have a pretty decent plan going on today. Which, if I can do all that, I would be so happy. Um, honestly, the boss battles aren't that hard if we get lucky enough with them. Um, the one is super easy. Uh, I believe his name is the Cannon Beetle. The Cannon Beetle is very is not a very hard boss battle at all. He is relatively easy. Um, then we have the Snavian, which the Snavian is if you get lucky enough to get his head stuck in the ground is a super easy boss fight. But I don't I don't know what the factors go behind that. I think if you drop his health like below half on the first turn that he pops up, then you actually he I think you're guaranteed he gets stuck. I think. But first I want to get as many um, leaves as I freaking can because I hate. Or not leaves, flowers, because I hate leaves. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, where are you at? Where are you at? Nectar! Nectar! No nectar. That's upsetting. Um, uh, maybe some nectar over here? Any nectar over here? Any nectar? Nectar? Yes, nectar. Actually, I think I got just about... I think they're all blue. Or I think... Yeah, of course they're all blue. I think they're all leaves. Yeah. <laughs> Please come over here. Ow, my throat hurts. I don't know what type that was about. Okay, first off, we're actually gonna kill this guy because he's going to be in our way. Okay, did not hit him. Wow, I still didn't hit him. My aim is off. <laughs> oh well, at least he didn't kill anybody. And this guy will also be in our way, so we're gonna kill his brother because I am a fan of murder. <laughs> Whoa! Oh no, 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 no! I did not need any of that. <laughs> Bastards. I forgot the termites could actually do that. So that that's actually, um... An inconvenience so what a waste of my time <laughs> come on um, we're gonna actually take uh, 16 oh uh, yes yeah, 16 Pikmin I want to leave myself with 60 I'm gonna take 16 we're gonna throw them all up there and they're gonna build that bridge while we actually go and get ourselves another ship piece I'm not actually gonna deliver any ship pieces until like right near the end of the day because I actually need all my Pikmin and just taking the time to do that is kind of an in inconvenience to me right now because I have a little bit of stuff I actually want to do. I actually got most of them up there, that's cool. That thing's a pain in the hoo-ha to get up there. Get up there, get up there. What you doing, you sliding? Look at this guy, he thinks he's like a snowboarder or something. Now I gotta get up there. Come on, come on, come on. We got 50, 56, there they are. Bastards. Oh my god, stop crashing your little brains in against the stones. And right here we have the shock absorber this apparatus contact con counteracts the shaking and swaying that normally occurs during flight it's smooth sailing with this in place usually um we're actually going to throw a bunch of pikmin on there and we're gonna come over here and we're gonna we're gonna attack him and if we can get him to shake nope we didn't get him to shake but he actually didn't eat that he only ate three pikmin which is actually fantastic <laughs> um i think that that's actually a really good run of that um, nice. Uh, it's just a lazy way. I think we could have actually got this ship piece earlier. I just forgot to come and get it, you know, because I, sometimes I forget stuff. I'm sorry. But we're actually going to leave that right about there. That looks good to me. And we're going to sneak on over here, and we're going to go fight the Snavian. I think that's his name. Honestly, I don't remember. If somebody could tell me what his real name is, because I can't really look it up right now. I'm recording. i probably look it up afterwards, and I'll, I'll, uh, you know, I'll just look it up afterwards, and I'll put the name on the screen somewhere, what his real name is. Because I, I, it, in Pikmin 2, I think they, they base their um, enemies off of um, families, and because he's a snake bird, they call him a Snavian. Because Avian's another name for bird, for all you youngins that don't know that. <laughs> um, and we're gonna, what the heck? Oh, he fell in the water. Oh my god, that is obnoxious. This is probably like one of, this is like one of my least favorite areas right here. Just because you can't. You have to waste time throwing all your Pikmin over there. I mean, it's not really wasting because you have to wait for these guys to move this anyway. But then they fall in the water, and it's just really a pain, and you gotta walk around, and it just makes me angry, and then they get stuck in the box! Okay. Um, you can't honestly take too many Pikmin across that bridge just because it's so narrow. Right there's the Snavian, but that's not the one we're actually gonna fight. We're gonna come over here and actually fight this one. So let's serpentine everybody over there, and you guys walk right back into the path of the bird. So I'm not really sure what causes you to get his head stuck in the ground. Ow, bastard. All I know is, um, I think you have to get health a little bit below half, which we did not do, because I suck. Yep, and you can actually attack him pretty much anywhere you want. 
No, 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 no. He actually can eat a good chunk of Pikmin if you let him. So, you, I, I don't know, I like to do it kind of like this, where the Pikmin stay, like, right around his body. And you can just kind of chuck right up at his head. His head's his weak spot. Um, nowhere else really does as much damage as his head. Oh, there we go. Then he got, then he gets stuck in the ground sometimes. Like that. You can do so much damage to him. Like, we killed him like that, so that is actually perfect that we saved... That saves a lot of time being able to kill him like that. And he explodes, and we get the... Geiger counter! Every spaceship needs one of these, but I don't actually know what it's for. Every once in a while it goes crazy and wild and lets out a lot of noise, but I never pay much attention to it, so it doesn't do me much good. I really should read the manual one of these days. Oh, Olimer. We're actually gonna uh, pick up all the scrap, and the fun, the good thing about actually killing him with blue Pikmin, or at least having blue Pikmin around, they don't go back to the path we came. They actually say, screw that path, and they go over the water, because they can breathe underwater. And I honestly, I don't know. Um, I think these are wa called water dumplings. Um, I think in the distant springs are actually, um, aggressive enemies, and right here they just, they don't do anything, so I'd imagine those are like the baby form of it, like a tadpole, but I, I'm not really sure, so, you know, it, it, what, it is what it is, and we're actually gonna get a good chunk of Pikmin from that 5, I'm happy that it actually dropped, uh, blue for once. I, I had a couple failed recordings of this one, and I didn't get a single blue pellet out of him. Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't get a single blue pellet out of it at all. Um, and we should just be about done with that bridge, actually, so we're gonna come over here and pick up this guy, and pick up these, and we're just gonna pick up all this crap, because we have, oh, yep, we're just, oh my god, no, I'm actually, I must be really far ahead of my schedule to actually be this far, so I'm gonna throw the rest of these guys on this bridge and help finish it. I think if, um, there's a glitch, if you actually have any Pikmin left under the bridge while it's being built and it gets over, I think they die instantly, so I gotta watch out for that. We good? No, we okay, still got one more. Okay. Hey! Don't be lazy! Do something! You stinking turd. There you go. Take that. And we're gonna take these guys, and we're gonna come over here and pick up, which I believe is called the Sagittarius. Is it, am I right? I found my Sagittarius, correct. My son gave this to me as a present. It brings to mind visions of my son back home on planet Rocketate. Oh, to be back there right now. We're gonna pick this crap up, and we're gonna get going. That's right, guys. We're almost done with the day, which is awesome. Wait, how many Pikmin do I have on there? 30? Okay, I thought I thought it said 30. Or no, I thought it said 20, and I was like, wait a minute, that, that seems a little high. Oh, well. There we go. We're gonna, I might as well just break all this other crap down. Might as well get the population as high as I freaking can. We're gonna need them anyway next level, so. There we go. Okay, and we're also gonna just stop this one, too. Just because we don't really need it, um, just brought in yet. And I wanna, I like having all these shit pieces here. I can bathe in the shit pieces. No. No. One of you get that. Just that. There you go. Perfect. We're actually gonna shove 20 Pikmin back in the ship. Because we're going to need some yellows. Actually, we don't, probably don't even need that many. Oh, well. They're going back in. i got to pick all these guys out. Oh, my God. This is what sucks about not having a full ship. Oh, then they're going to shoot out more. You guys anger me so much. Oh, well. It's honestly, it's probably for the best. We're going to need as many blues in my mind, in my opinion, as we can get. Because uh, the distance springs, I'm probably going to run through a lot of blues. Um, because there's a lot of enemies in that area that can just do damage and kill you. Um, I actually, I think I did pretty good against this team. I don't think I lost that many Pikmin, honestly. And we just got that one solo guy right over here. And you. We probably, we honestly don't even need all those, all those yellows. We're only gonna need ten. Um, I don't know why I always get out a little bit more, but you know, it never hurts. Come on, let's go get some bomb rocks. Let's go get some bomb rocks. Come on, come on, you turds. Look at you sleeping. I wish, uh, I mean, it'd kind of suck if the whistle did, but I kind of wish the whistle would wake them up just for, like, strategic usage and stuff. Perfect, and he didn't cry to wake up his mom, which is nice. Let your mom sleep in for the day. Hey, no, we need bomb rocks. Okay, I think I got them all. I got a bunch. Perfect. That is excellent. We only really need three. Um, I think you can actually blow the door down. I'm gonna blow down with just three, but, you know, it never hurts to have extra. I don't- I- I don't know if you can actually use bomb rocks in the battle. 
Um, that'd be kind of cool. Uh, the beetle, when you fight him, he will show a weakness, and it's only there for a little bit, but I would, I could imagine um, the Pikmin actually being able to throw a bomb rock fast enough to actually hit him. We're gonna kill this little baby, because a baby slaughter today! I almost said baby abortion. <laughs> I was like, whoa, that is definitely not the right word. Uh, that is not the kind of thing you want to bring up. No, no! Oh, you fell. Okay, you actually missed. Kill him, kill him. Perfect. Oh, oh, we lost seven. That's not too bad. Okay, so we need those guys. Come over here. And I'm going to pause you right there. And you guys, what do I got? Nine. I will actually throw you guys on that. So you guys can take that back to your ship. And I'll throw him yeah, too. That's fine. Nope, stay there. Okay, you know what? That, that'll work. I'll just make sure I throw the right damn Pikmin. There we go. Throw one. He'll go up. Throw the rock. Why did he throw the rock? He's supposed to go up and lay the rock. Oh, my camera's freaking out. Nope, not you. Nope, there we go. Um, I, the problem with throwing more Pikmin at this, because they both have to walk a little bit of a distance, they, the second one actually freaks out and just kind of drops the bomb. Or doesn't drop the bomb. He just doesn't even, like... Oh, shit, I forgot to... I forgot to go break down the door while I did that. So now we gotta wait for the damn door. Mobby. So, we're actually gonna do this. I should've did this from the very beginning and stuck all these guys here. Yeah, just go smash your faces in that door. There you go, good job. You're standing there, perfect. Okay, I want you. I want you. I want you to love me. I want... Well, how's the song go? I want you to love me. I think it goes like that or something. Boom. Yeah! Oh, and it's yellow, too. There you go. Perfect. And you guys can honestly just stay right there. This door should be just about broken. Just about. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. I'm gonna tickle you with the whistle. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Perfect. Let's go. Let's go. And we gotta go kill the, the cannon beetle. Da -da 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 -da. It's actually a really easy boss fight. Oh, he's going the wrong way. Hey, hey, look at me. Look at me. You just gotta throw Pikmin in there. I just like throw multiple Pikmin just to make sure I make it in there. And then once he opens his, uh, his weak spot, which is really hot, it looks like you'd, you'd think you'd actually need reds to do this. But no, any, any Pikmin can also do it. And I don't think you can really kill him on the first try. Um, maybe on the GameCube version, because you can throw Pikmin a lot faster with the C-Stick in there. Um, that might be, that actually might be a possible factor. Stop running away from me! Love me! Oh, I was gonna say, if he didn't die from that, I was gonna be so angry. Okay, so we're actually gonna get our next piece right here, which is the Radiation Canopy. All it pretty much does is protect Olimar from radiation. That should be good. Is that good? Yep, perfect. And I actually want to take him back, too. I could care less about the tiny the tiny ones. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. There we go. Perfect. Everybody's on there, and I'm going to run back to the ship. Okay, guys, sorry about that little cut. <laughs> that was a little distraction. I'm back. Where am I? What am I doing? Uh, what's going on? Oh, yellow. Yeah, okay, that's, that is right. Um, how far are they with that ship piece? They actually can just carry it right over, which is cool. I'm going to come over here and actually pick all these yellows, uh, because I'm not... You guys can't do that. Oh no, but we can actually start delivering these pieces, which is a good freaking idea. Um, what do we got, 25? We can deliver this at least. There we go. Oh, and I can pick out these other guys and we can deliver it. No, I don't care about the Sagittarius. No, I said no, I want to pick the Pikmin! Which is actually a really good idea to actually start uh, delivering this, so it's going to be a little close. Um, I was originally going to uh, empty my yellows into the ship, which I had found out because I had a failed recording of this. I had found out if I do that, um, all the blues that I could get actually just shoot out everywhere and I don't have enough time to pick them. So, I gotta actually get all these guys. And what do I got? I got nine. Do I have 30? 30, 32. Oh, man. No, wait, wait. I actually have enough to pick up the other the other piece, which is cool. And then, well, there's the space canopy, so we're actually gonna have enough pieces for everything. <laughs> or enough Pikmin for everything. Awesome! Today's going fantastic. And we have everybody's, like... Uh, the yellow population got boosted up, too. The radiation canopy. I'll have to inspect it later to make sure it hasn't cracked. I'll be in for even more trouble if I have any radiation leaks. But you've already been living without... Radiate. You are... I'm confused, Olimar. You've already been in this radiation. Oh. Oh, well. You know, I'm not worried about it. It's Olimar's life. He do... He does what he wants, man. He does what he wants. He's out of mer. Out of mer. <laughs> this was a gift for my son. He must be very worried about me. We have now recovered 18. And we're gonna get recovered this, so we'll actually have, what, 19? Yeah. I can do math. I do math well. 
and they can deliver that. And that Pikmin, watch that Pikmin counter. That thing is gonna go crazy. Actually, I think I think it only. I don't know how many it actually gives you. I'm kind of curious myself. <laughs> it doesn't show the other piece. It just shows this Pikmin in a circle. It's really creepy. This nifty little device kind of racks the shaking and swaying experience in typical space flight. Aw, oh, yeah, I've now recovered 19 to 30 ship pieces. Ten more to go. And I've, I'm actually really curious to see how, how much that goes up by. Oh, wow. Wow, that actually went up a lot. Oh, okay, well, that's pretty much the end of the day, guys. Um, I'm going to dump all these Pikmin, and I'm just going to go exploring a little bit in the next ten seconds. Because I ain't got nothing else to do. Because I'm Olimer. I live a hardcore, a hardcore life. Olimer. Olimer. I got no Pikmin. No Pikmin got left behind, right? Perfect. And this level is, honestly, it's done. We don't have anything else to do here. Um, I'm going to come over here and just uh, kill some more babies. Because that's, that's how Olimar gets down. He kills babies. He's a baby hater. <laughs> you take that sticky baby. You dead baby. You're gonna die too. You watched your brother die. Now I'm gonna kill you in vain. Cause I don't care about you. I don't care about your family. Uh, where's your mama at? I'm gonna punch your mama in the face. <laughs> she didn't even wake up. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> we ain't got no more Pikmin, but every end of the day sequence is exactly the same unless your Pikmin get eaten, so. A decent impact. There are now only 11 parts that I still need to retrieve. Will I be able to recover the remaining parts in 22 more days? Surely there are some parts that are not absolutely necessary. If my ship is not complete by day 30, the only way I'll find out is to try to lift off. I just recalled the day I took my son for a ride in the spaceship. He was so happy. I shall tell him of this journey when I return, and I shall return. I must! I can already see the look of wonder on his precious face as I describe my adventures with the Pikmin. Okay, guys. That actually, the today actually went really well. Barely lost 20 battle. That's honestly not too bad. Um, wow, we have we have over 400. Wait, to oh, okay, no total. <laughs> okay, I was gonna say we had over 400 Pikmin. No, there's no way we have over 400. But you know, it is what it is. We have a good chunk of Pikmin though, so pretty good day. How many? Wait, does it take? Yeah, we have 321 total. Okay, so we yeah, because we've lost a little over 100. So total sprouted doesn't really matter. <laughs> Anyway, thank you guys. Thank you all so much for watching this episode of Le Pikmin. Next episode, we are going to dive into the springs, and we're going to see how well that will actually go. So, as always, I've been Geratino, and I'll see you guys next time. Later, everybody.